Why does sin not bother us? Why don't we see just how wicked sin really is? In order to explain that, let me go back to the Garden of Eden. You see, in the Garden, Satan came and he tempted Eve. When Adam and Eve sinned, they died spiritually. So Satan was the tempter, but sin was the killer. Jesus came to save us from sin and the consequences of sin, which is eternal death, separation from the Father. It was because of sin that we were separated from God. You see, sin is our ultimate enemy, and Jesus came to save us from it. But the question is, why don't we shudder at the idea of sinning? Why don't we see the danger in sin? Why don't we see just the wickedness of our own sin? Why can't we comfortably go about sinning, and that night we can just go to bed and sleep well, wake up the next morning and just keep living our lives? We trivialize sin in such a big way, and why is it? It's because we do not know the holiness of the God we sin against. You see, it was, it was David who said, God against you and you alone have I sinned. We think we sin against people when we sin, and when people forgive us, we're okay. Or when a relationship breaks, that's kind of like as bad as it gets. But really, it's against God whom we sin. That's what makes sin so evil and so wicked. Imagine this for a moment. Two guys playing basketball. And um, as they were playing, they got into a disagreement, and emotions flared up, and it ended up in a massive argument where one guy puts his finger in the other guy's face and says, I'm going to take you out and he threatens him with those words. Well, the most that was going to come from that is that people are going to say, hey, listen, calm down, you guys. This is just a game. But imagine, in another context, the same guy standing in front of the President of the United States. He puts his finger in the President's face, and he threatens him with the exact same words. And he says, I will take you out to the President. Immediately, that becomes a crime. You will have the FBI and the secret agents all chasing after that guy, and they will imprison him for that. Why? Because of who it is that he threatened. In the same way, our sin is dangerous, it is wicked, it is evil. Why? Because of who it is that we have sinned against. You know, the world doesn't have need for Jesus. They really couldn't care about Jesus. Why not? Because they do not recognize or realize the wickedness of their sin. Why don't they realize how wicked their sin is? Because they do not know the holiness of the God whom they are sinning against. If this message means anything to you and you're saying, I need forgiveness for sins, know this, that you can only find forgiveness of your sins in Jesus Christ. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. We hope that you're blessed by these video messages my husband Jacques is putting out. If so, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you're watching on Facebook, be sure to like and follow. We love you, we're praying for you, and thanking God for His plans and purposes to prosper in your life.